Hello everybody. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. If not, welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a bake with me video. I'm going to be baking a strawberry pie with strawberry buttercream frosting. So let's get started. All right, well first off, you're going to start by preheating your oven to 350 degrees and you wanna make sure that you have a rack in the center of the oven. Next, you wanna take a small bowl and combine your freshly cut strawberries and your pureed strawberries. So I did that here. Then you wanna combine your flour, salt, and baking soda. So I'm going to do that here. You want to take some butter, put it in your mixer, and then you wanna mix your butter and your sugar together. So I'm gonna put the sugar in. I'm gonna mix that together. And you wanna mix that together for about two or three minutes until it's light and fluffy. Sometimes you have to scrape the edges so that it gets mixed in evenly. Let's continue mixing. So after you finish mixing those two together, you want to get your egg whites, pour it in, and you also want some vanilla. You just pour some of that in, and you want to mix that until it's pretty well combined. So once you got that combined, you wanna take your flour mixture and your milk and you wanna alternate with putting the flour and then the milk until it's um, finished and mixed. Again, you want to scrape along the sides to make sure that everything's getting mixed in evenly. Okay, so after you finish mixing that, you want to just, you want to put this in, but you only want to mix it for a minute. You only want to gently fold it in. So next, you want to prepare your pans. You can either use um, like nonstick spray or oil. I like to use butter. I just take a little bit on some paper towel and then rub it around in the pan. And then I just take a little bit of flour and just dust them. So it helps it um, not stick as much. You 
want to take your mixture and disperse it evenly over the two pans or however many pans you're using. Okay, so you want to make sure that you just even it out a little bit. Um, you don't want them too full because they it will rise and you don't want it to overflow in the oven because that's messy. Um, so you just even it out. Okay. So it's time to put them in the oven um, for about 25 minutes. And while they are baking, I'm going to make the frosting and I will see you when they're done. Okay, so for the strawberry buttercream frosting, you are going to want a, um, a cup of butter. And you wanna um, just cream that for a second and get it light and fluffy. just add a um, little splash of vanilla mix that up a tiny bit and then you want to gradually add your powdered sugar um, you want four cups of powdered sugar and as that mixes in you want to just take a little bit of milk um, whole milk and just add it as you need it um, to help the consistency and texture of the frosting. All right, well, it looks like my cakes, um, the timer for my cakes have gone off, so I'm going to check on that. are done in order to tell if the cakes are done or not you can either take a toothpick and put it in the middle and if it comes out clean then it's done you can also just like pat on it um, very lightly and if it bounces back then it should be done so let's add the rest of this powdered sugar Once your frosting is done mixed and you think that the consistency and texture is good um, you can go ahead and take some more of your strawberry puree that you made earlier for the cake and just put like a tea not a tea you can just put like a tablespoon or two in it um, depending on how you like it you don't want to put too much because you don't want the frosting to be too watery but you do want um, some of that in the frosting so that it is strawberry buttercream Thank you. 
I'm going to let my cakes cool and then I am going to frost them. But in the meantime, I'm going to put the frosting in the fridge so that it doesn't melt too much. So I will see you then. Okay, so now it's time to frost the cake. So you can see I have the bottom of the cake on the um, cake stand and I already um, cut part of the um, bottom layer. I just evened it out. So we're going to take some frosting, put it on there, spread it around. Then you want to take your top layer and put it on top. And then you just want to frost the whole cake. frosted I will go ahead and clean up the edges and stuff later but um now I am going to take my piping bag it's got the same frosting and I'm just gonna make little dollops on top to garnish it with some fresh strawberries. strawberry cake with strawberry buttercream frosting. I will have the recipe linked down below. Let me know if you make it and if you like it. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And let me know if you would like to do more bake with me or cooking videos. See you next time. Bye.